Okay, Ray H. in Michigan. You ready to get started on your 2547? You can see I got the covers off of it already. Uh, just taking a look inside. You wanted a build video of it. So, here it is. Okay, I've already checked it out. It, everything works. So I'm getting ready to start the uh, upgrades. Alright, more to come. Okay. I got uh, both capacitors out. Okay, got the got the filter out, and also got your first RF amp out. I've already changed the bias around on the receive circuit, and uh, getting ready to uh, put the upgraded stuff back in, and then uh, do the tune-up. Okay, more to come. Okay, Ray, I wanted to show you the slide. Uh, we're on AM now. 27405 is center slot. And that's five down right there. And it goes about two past that, or actually one and a half. So, about one and a half past that. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to get a good angle so you can see the digits and all the other crap. There we go. Ah, and then it goes up to 4103. So it goes up just a tad over 5 on AM. Now let me center this back up and show you the difference between the modes. That's AM, upper side, lower side. So it looks like I need to touch upper side up just a little bit. Upper AM, lower. Ah, God damn it. Alright. too far touch it okay lower side AM upper side okay all right just remember with this button out your clarifier is locked okay so you want to keep this button pushed in so you can use your clarifier all right oh uh, Oh, and I wanted to show you how well this A&L works. And let me switch to outside antenna. Hang on just a second. Need to replace that switch but the noise is not there now it comes and goes but that a and l just knocked it out now i've also made modifications to your uh radio so you can turn that hash down you can instead of a high cut i've incorporated the high cut into the tone circuit Okay, so you can set that wherever you want it. It's kind of, it's variable. Down to super quiet. Which is nice. Alright, turn it up. Okay. Alright. Uh, you didn't order a kit, so you're nine normal nine switch or nine normal 19 switch uh, still works okay normally i would put the kit right there where that's at all right more to come okay we're doing power checks now uh, 
I've got 100 watt slugs on both sides. This side is RMS. This is the uh, meter on the left. Get this canned air out of the way. The meter on the left, the meter on the right is peak. And I'm on the times one scale on the peak reading meter. So we'll be reading on the bottom scale on both of these. Okay. Bottom scale on both. All right. I am on AM. Let me get down to channel 20. All right. Channel 20 AM. We're on peak power. Audio. Hello. Hello. Audio. Audio. About 42 watts peak. Dead key in about 10 watts. Audio. Swing it up to about 12 or 14. I couldn't really tell. Uh, now, if I turn RF power all the way down. Did I turn? Was that RF power? Nope. This is RF power. We did key about 2 watts, a little bit over 2 watts. Audio. Audio. Swings up to about 10, but look what it does on peak. Audio. Audio. Funny how that works, ain't it? All right, turn the RF power all the way back up. And switch to lower sideband. Okay, still looking at the peak meter. Still on the 100 watt scale, which is on the bottom. Audio, audio one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. About 36 watts peak. And see what RMS does. Audio, 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 audio. A little over 35 on RMS. Okay. All right. She's a talker. Let me get the covers put back on it. Be right back. Okay, Ray H in Michigan. This is your less common proved LC. Uh, actually, this is the DX2547. Okay, it's got all the less common updates in it. I think I've showed you that. Uh, we also expanded the clarifier. Uh, and locked your transmit and receive together. So remember to keep this button pushed in to use the clarifier. Uh, yeah, see that? Got that noise back again. Hear that? And how well that automatic noise limiter works. That's like a static power line static. Noise blanker is like for pulse noise, like a spark plug noise from lawnmowers, things of that nature. That ANL is for uh, like transformer noise, electrical noise, static. All right. And I went back and double checked uh, your order just to make sure you didn't order any kind of channel kit and I could not find where you had so uh, like I said normally we would put it on that uh, control right there but since you didn't order one then uh, we've got uh, just a regular 40 channel sideband radio that performs extremely well okay Ray I uh, gotta hook it up to do the 24 hour burn in, but it's basically done. So I sure hope you enjoy your new radio. It was my pleasure to set it up for you. 7 3, everybody.